Alright, what is up guys, and as always, welcome back to another Wi-Fi Bell. Now we're going up against Goal again, and the reason is he actually really, really wanted a regame thought that it didn't go his way and wanted to show that he could be stronger, better, and more meaner. So with that in mind, I'll, I'll respect that invitation as um, I'll choose to bring a different team this time to uh, try to match his, um, his team. And well, let's just face it. He brought a lander this time, so I heavily insist that this is nastier, scarier, and by default, tougher. So, he starts off with Celesteel again this time. Damn shame, really. Um, Heavy Slam destroys my Auroras, and I know that. So, it's not the best situation to be in. Besides Residual, which actually is fine. Um, Question is, should he have his slam? I have a, you know, a Celesteel on my own, as always, pleasure to have, but I have every reason in the world to think he would do something else. And I can't do anything there, I can't do anything there. He's not gonna Earthquake though, he's gonna Leech Seed if anything. So I'm gonna send in my Regilicky and um, do the Easy Reflect play, I think. Uh, I want to see if you just lead seeds. Yeah, there we go. So you should have lead seed, protect, earthquake, we've already kind of seen, and uh, probably heavy slam. And I think my existence alone scares him out. But if I were him, I'd probably switch out to something safer like Garchomp. And uh, I'm actually just going to get my reflect up. Now, I don't manage to survive. Um, yeah, like you are absolutely getting out of there. Two Landorus. So I think it's gonna be a bit disappointed that I am a bit of a bulkier build with, um, you know, reflect in mind. <laughs> so buff put his hand or hail, and so will you. But yeah, Leech Slave is um, mildly annoying. Question is, with the Mons active, like Ishkenda is a really good natural switching. Aurora's kinda good. Undyne really doesn't lose anything, and actually, unless he has Stone Edge, I don't believe it's gonna do a whole lot. If it goes from Earthquake, you know, we're clearly gonna sting, but uh, not a whole lot. Stealth Rock, so good neutral play, nothing to it. I have at least two turns off um, hail, so that's plenty for me. The question is, Fish's rend is kind of nice overall, right? There's really no real good switch in. Let's see. Two more turns of hail. So Fish's rend followed up with a free try, depending on what he decides to do. He stays in, loses Lando, easy, easy peasy. <laughs> Got him. So, follow that up with... That's the thing though. Yeah, like, he clearly comes in. Max Knuckle is not something I necessarily enjoy. Even though I'll probably take it. So, we freeze dry here. <laughs> because we can and what we'll do oh yeah you're too shot by that buddy close combat let's see oh and we are absolutely dying <laughs> damn shame <laughs> all right it's not it's not the worst um though i don't think i need a hill much more that's actually all right um so, just really leveling here. I am in a situation where I could belly drum here. Because I have every reason in the world to think he's scarfed. And I don't think he enjoys this matchup. Because I'll probably switch out. 
yeah like there we go nothing to it Celestila here we come and I by the way I don't think I enjoy anything that Celestila does here um, at all but I can always strain punch and I think I'm gonna do all right uh, I'm very unsure how much this heavy slam will do but I do have it to reflect behind me so I'm, I just want that essence to kind of kick in let's see drain punch will do yeah around half like so we recover a good chunk so it's all about that heavy slam really <laughs> please Jesus don't oh no 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 we're good we're good we're good but basically it, it only works like right now um, because of yeah <laughs> because it can't damn reflect and I don't know how long we have that reflect up how many turns? we have one more turn ref reflect so we'll actually manage to live this unless it switches out which probably is the better call and sacking something else oh this is tough for him this is tough this is tough for me too of course but I feel I have some type of leverage here yeah if we draw it like that makes more sense to Espeon alright because I will have them I will be able to be full healthy which is gonna be incredible for me but yeah this heavy slam is gonna be doing numbers on me so I'll just try to recover as much as I can like that's the play right that's gotta be the play I'm just thinking would he Dynamax here also Volcarona is kind of a good switch in he does decide to bring in Celesteela instead which, like I said, I am somewhat scared of uh, the Dynamax here. He can always protect. Decide not to. And I think the Heavy Slam is gonna absolutely kill me. And there is nothing I can do. Oh my god. Don't. Oh. <laughs> then again, like I said, that was the right call. <laughs> Peace boost and he'll get defense it's not too shabby not too shabby um, because I got him in a range where I feel somewhat confident so how do I want to do this I think I can send in Iskender um, I'm not in the best position, but I sure as hell can abuse this because I know he has Earthquake and Heavy Slam since before so Leech Seed is probably his only real play so we're gonna Tornomize here to get the speed up versus the matchup that can outspeed me yeah, there's Leech Seed, nothing to it And I was absolutely seated. Because the way I go about this is first I ear slash. Because it's going to protect. And then after this, I'll use Meteor Beam, knock him out. Because he probably thought I was going to be Fire Blast. So he's going to recover a whole lot here. But I'm pretty confident I should be able to outs or knock him out as uh, he showed case that he was um, getting defense races instead. Or it does a hard switch, which also kind of makes sense. We'll see what happens. I am nervous. 
he's really thinking about this, so it's not an easy call for him either, clearly. He just decided to stay in, which is great. Hopefully, we don't miss. Come on, buddy. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. I need this. Don't miss it. Yes. And how much will this do? Plus one. Come on. That's gotta be. Yeah. That like that's gonna be it. Hell yes. Beast boost. Beast boost. Japanese name. Hmm. I'll use your slash here. Please don't Dynamax on me. Yes! Yes! You got the nope, buddy. You got the nope. <laughs> Can't believe we're doing this. Ishkender. I knew you had it in you. Then again, you know, this was all Aurora's. This was all Aurora's, really. Here comes Moltres. And, um... We're gonna turn on the heat, aren't we? I mean, really, at this point, I gain nothing by being too mean, but I don't care. I just don't care. <laughs> Give me the leverage I decided unneeded. You, you snagged a victory for me last time, gold. I am absolutely gonna snag my victory back. Plus, I'm pretty sure you're gonna Dynamax on me anyway. So let's see who is the superior monster here. <laughs> yeah, called it. Called it. <laughs> you think he's gonna get that cheap shot on me? No, you're not. No, you are not. I'm absolutely gonna ruin you. Then again, Meteor Beam, you know, it's not stabbed. I know that. So, we're gonna see how much this Dark will do, really. I do want speed, plus two on special attack. Come on. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. You are not going to reverse sweep me. No way in hell. I knew what you were thinking. <laughs> <laughs> oh, the salt. Oh, the salt is real. Oh, I'm sorry, man. Yeah, that was not gonna work. Not now, not ever. So, Gold, if you're still on Twitter... <laughs> dude. <laughs> Don't be this guy. Don't be this salty guy. <laughs> so, as always, guys, thank you for, of course, watching. And hope you guys enjoy this game, and I'll see you in the next video. Until then, as always, take care of one. Bye.